Welcome to week number two for Liz. Gut health. As you know, I work with a lot of people helping them lose weight. This is not what we're trying to do with Liz. Our Liz is just trying to improve our gut and feel better. So that is the um, the success, how we are measuring Liz. And here she is now. I will send her a little invitation to add her into this live video here she is Hi. and we've got sound we've got video all is working Amazing. well Liz. <laughs> right first of all how are you feeling very good very good thank you you're um, looking I, good uh, it's it's not blusher this is because it's warm in the car <laughs> 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 yeah, no, mate. I don't do makeup. I just do the odd little bit of mascara, and so yeah, this is au naturel, as you can see. But, yeah, I no, feel, it's... I feel, I feel lovely. Yes. So uh, when we did last week's video, uh, some people were quite worried that you were going to dramatically lose weight. So just to confirm, you haven't lost any weight this week, have you? Uh, no, I've actually put some weight on. Um, yeah. So. Which is which is fine because yes. this is not the aim of nope. the game. You know, our aim of the game is to feel good, improve our gut yeah. health, isn't it? Loads of people were in the um, school grounds, playgrounds, going, "Oh my God, what just you want to lose weight for?" And it's like, no, I don't want to lose the weight. It's because I want to feel better. I want my skin yeah. and my hair, and my nails to feel better. But I feel I don't feel tired anymore i haven't got that fatigue i used to be having a nap in the afternoons but it's but doing the morning routine half seven in the morning wakes me up and it feels nice no aches and pains yeah. So you've been doing my 7.30 daily stretch every morning which is good yeah. like you said it just uh, prepares you for the day yeah it does and nutrition Nutritionally, so you've been having your protein shakes, you've been having your gut health greens, and you've been having some fizz yep. sticks. How have you been getting on with them? So I have, I make sure I have this for the whole day. So this is my fizz stick. Hello, cheers. So I have cheers. one fizz stick for the whole day, and I make sure that I also have a bottle of water as well. Because if I don't see it, I won't drink it. I would go, oh, I'm not thirsty. I won't need a drink. But because I see my bottle, it's there that I have to take it. But it's, yes, you do pee a little bit more, which is not a problem. It's a good thing. Um, and I saw the live earlier on that, yes, even though my fizz stick is this colour, it still comes out fluorescent. Yes, it does, which is a little bit strange. Uh, I don't know why, uh, but uh, you get used to it. Yeah. Um, so last week I gave you the challenge to have as many snacks as you like, as long as they are healthy and full of nutrients. Yep. Did you enjoy yeah, that? Yeah, I did. I, I, have, I eat so much chicken. I've got a little list on the side of what I can and can't eat. And... I sometimes, but I'm, I don't feel starving when I'm on the protein. So I have the um, the greens in the morning. I'll have a protein shake, dinner and tea. But I haven't got that hunger. I'm not starving or I'm not picking on any foods. Yeah. But if I am peckish, I'll eat some chicken. I'll eat a little bit of salad. Yeah. I'll eat just some. Um, I've got some chickpeas the other day that I'm going to um, roast. Is in Roast, just yeah. a, a little nibble, but I look, it's just nice not to have cravings for sugar or cravings for chocolate. I used to have, oh, well, I brought the boys a whole pack of Mars bars, and one day I was, I ate the whole lot, as in five yeah. bars, but I haven't got that now, and it's like, I don't fancy it. I fancy a watermelon instead, or I fancy some strawberries. So it's, yeah. it's new to me as well. That's, you know, that's all to do with your gut health changing and you're actually, you know, healing yourself yeah. from the inside yeah. as well. For anybody who didn't watch last week's video, uh, you've actually got um, a 
inflammation in your yeah, gut, so haven't you? Microns uh, which disease. is a long term condition. So this is why it's more important for you to focus on gut health rather than you know your actual yeah. weight management it's if you eat different types of foods even they've got healing properties as well and it's nice to counsel out all of those foods that give you inflammation because it's not just your gut it's it's your it's your body it's everything yeah. and doing it bit by bit day by day taking out those foods you get a better feeling of yourself so I feel 100%. like I'm 22 again, not... And you look great compared to last week. You know, I think I can see different, already. Yeah, different. So I'm really right. happy. Have you got any questions? Because that's it from me no, for good. this week. No, I'm good. So I'm, um, I'm literally eating moderate, um, doing my protein shakes, and but I'm doing more exercise. Oh, the thing I've got is I've got treated myself to a little Fitbit. Oh, yeah. Yay! Cheers. So I am. I'm learning on them, but I'll. Um, I need to read the book on how to do it properly. Right, and I need to add you to our Fitbit group then as well. Okay, don't okay. I? Fabulous. Yeah. Wonderful. Right. Well, thank you for the update. We will catch you up next week. Cheers, Jodie. Thank you. All right. Thanks, Liz. Bye.